Welcome to another one of our series in Problem Water. Today we're going to look at total dissolved solids, suspended solids, color, and turbidity. In the left-hand glass we are adding sodium chloride. I'm not going to add a defined quantity. I just want to demonstrate the solubility and extreme solubility of sodium chloride. Uh, we can add quite a bit before the water becomes saturated and the sodium chloride would no longer go into solution. Sodium chloride is not the only ion that can be dissolved in water. Water is known as the universal solvent and dissolves quite a few ions including calcium carbonate. Calcium carbonate is lime. Here's some limestone and here's a depiction of what lime can look like in your pipes or on your glasses. Think about it on your skin or on your clothes. It causes itchiness if you don't take it out of the water before a shower. In the right-hand glass, we're adding pepper. Pepper will de demonstrate two constituencies, suspended solid and color, dash turbidity. Turbidity is simply the inability for light to pass through the water effectively. And there's a measurement that can be done to determine the amount of turbidity in the water. As you will see, the water will turn darker as we add more pepper, not only due to the flakes, because the flakes will float to the top, but also due to the change or the, the tannins coming off of the pepper. In nature, tannins come from leaves and other organics, and most surface waters have some level of tannic acid in them. Again, we'll stir the salt side, uh, the left-hand side. You can see the salt's almost totally dissolved. And we'll add a little bit, we'll stir the pepper side a little bit more just to get more color to come off of the pepper. You can see it's much darker compared to the sodium chloride side. I'll put some more salt in here just to demonstrate the amount of salt that can be held in solution by the water. If you have any of these problems, please contact us. We can discuss treatment systems. Sodium chloride can be removed by ion exchange or by reverse osmosis. Color can be removed by also ion exchange and reverse osmosis. Suspended solids through simple filtration. Please give us a call at the number on the screen or email us at the uh, email addresses shown. Thank you for watching this presentation and we appreciate your participation here.